Dido, the most powerful atomic research reactor in Western Europe, goes into operation at Harwell. A 12-ton flask carries uranium fuel to the top of the reactor while experts keep a careful watch on the big control panels. The rods of heavily enriched uranium are lowered into Dido's heart. Some of these compartments are for testing components of other reactors. For one of Dido's big assets is that it can reduce from years to weeks the time needed to test the parts of the nuclear power stations of the future. Outside the reactor itself, in heavily shielded rooms, is a mass of electronic equipment for many other experiments which Dido makes possible. Research into the properties of metal, the structure of crystals, the behavior of neutrons, and a host of other problems to which science needs ever more precise answers. A few yards away is another new reactor, Lido, with a model to show how it works. Lido is a swimming pool reactor mainly for shielding experiments. The reactor fuel is lowered into a 24-foot tank of water to provide, among other things, data for the building of Britain's first atomic submarine engine.